Are, are you, do you know a lot of theory or are you kind of a lot self-taught? I would say I took like a lot of classes like in college and high school and did a lot of programs for theory and stuff. I would say like I, I know enough, but Colin knows more. Yeah, <laughs> we were talking about, we had our drummer David on an episode and we had a really interesting conversation about like, we don't know if it kind of helps or harms you more to know more music theory. Cause like, I, I, I know that stuff a little bit, but yeah. our other singer songwriter, Jake doesn't know any of it. And so when he picks up his guitar, he doesn't go into it knowing any rules to kind of trap him in right. certain parameters. So he'll just play a chord. And even if it's not in the key, if it sounds good, it doesn't matter to him. Right. What do you, what do you think about that? See, I think like, like it can help and harm because if you go there and it helps you, it's like if you have a part in a song where you don't know what to do and you know theory, you're like, okay, maybe I could do this. But also it can inhibit you, I think, in a way where you're like, you feel like you might be trapped. Or yeah. So I, I, I don't know. I think they both have qualities, pros and cons, obviously, just like everything. But I, 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 I don't know. I guess it depends what you're doing. I guess if you were like a serious jazz musician, then you would have to know it. But I, I don't know. I, I feel like if you're writing songs that make you feel good and they sound good, then that's it's, it's good. Well said. Very well said.